What is the FIFA commenters? He's six foot one, four star skill, four star weak foot, extremely strong, very fast, and very clean in front of the goal. You might just want to complete this, but let's start this episode. If you're new on this corners, you know how it goes. Drop a like on this video, subscribe to the channel, and of course, do let me know in the comment section below if you are enjoying your FIFA experience at the moment. Boys, today, ESports has gone ahead and released a player that goes by the name of Pedro, uh, not Pedro, but Gonjalo Ramos. Gonjalo Ramos, the, the, the mystery man, really the mystery man. This guy, of course, is a Portuguese international and let's just talk about portugal today morocco incredible incredible what a team uh the heart that this team has to be able to qualify it's just sensational let's just talk really quickly about portugal and, and the fact that this man right here was sensational against switzerland stepped up to the plate really and took on his responsibilities but i have to say boys that it's not just about uh it's not just about the occasional player i really think where uh where portugal messed up this world cup is that there wasn't enough unity in the team right there wasn't enough unity of course with the cristiano ronaldo whole thing happening and you know everybody if he if he lifts an eyebrow everybody says he lifted an eyebrow oh how are his you know his colleagues on the team thinking about uh or feeling about the fact that he lifted an eyebrow no, it, it, like the media did not help. And I really think the lineup should have been consistent. Cristiano Ronaldo should have been, uh, you know, should have been responsible to lead this team till the end. Uh, you know, it's either with him or it's not with him. That's it. That's all. This guy was good. He stepped up to the plate, scored his three goals, did his hat trick, first hat trick in the World Cup. But what are we looking at today? They brought in Cristiano N later in the game and he can he can he can make it happen. I, I don't know. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section below what you think about this. But moving on to where else this guy has played in the past. He graduated the Youth Academy of Benfica 2013 to 2019. Youth and, and the youth at as part of his youth career. Then he moved to Benfica B 2019 to 2021. Three seasons, 37 goals. And then since 2020 has been playing for Benfica, the main team, uh, and has done has uh, then 45 appearances, scoring 20 goals. Now, moving on to the card we have on screen. He is a uh, four-star skill, four-star weak foot. That's fantastic. Six foot one, medium high, right-footed. That is very good. He can only play alternatively as a center forward, and then you can move him across the pitch wherever you want. Minute one, that's up to you. Moving on to the player attributes. These are really good, honestly. I, I feel like his pace should, should have been a little bit higher, you know, from the get-go. But he does get 89 acceleration, 87 sprint speed. That is good. You might want to apply something like a finisher. Uh, it's up to you. You might want to put a, a finisher. Or if, if you want, you could also go ahead with a hunter. And that should be A-OK -okay for a player like this. Moving on to the passing. Uh, the vision is, is a bit low. The short pass is decent. The long pass is decent as well. He, of course, cannot cross or anything like that. So, you know, he's a striker. He's a... Uh, he's a he's a second striker you know in, in a two striker formation but not never put him on the wings that's that's for sure moving on to his dribbling his dribbling he is high and average body type I didn't link my uh, my foot bend, so you're not going to see that today. But he's high on average body type. That's fantastic. Now, looking at the, the chem styles you could put on him, like I was saying, uh, in terms of his dribbling, he already has 88 agility, 86 balance, 84 reaction, 84 ball control, 85 composure. That is very good. So, like I was saying, a finisher could be sensational. That would boost the dribbling, boost the, the, the shooting. But you might also want to boost that, that, that pass, that, that pace. Sorry, you could go with the, the hunter for that, which would boost the pace, boost the shooting as well. Or the last one would be the engine, which would boost the dribbling dribbling, boost the, the passing and the pace a little bit there as well. Moving on to defending, he does have 94 heading accuracy, 92 jumping. That's fantastic, really. Uh, 91 stamina, 85 strength, 87 uh, aggression. He is very, very strong. Uh, and, you know, those dribbling stats are really good that you combine with his physicality, his presence in the box, he's going to be very good. He also has a finesse shot uh, attribute. I, I tried him in the arena. Mm, the finesse shot wasn't that great on the base card. But in terms of animation, you really feel like this guy is the, is the um, a little bit more agile than, than, than a physical player like Nunez, right? Nunez is very tall, very strong. But you get with a, a, a Gonzalo Ramos, a player that is a little bit a little bit more agile because of that uh, uh, 88 agility and balance. Now, what you will need to complete this uh, SBC is very simple. You will need uh, for the first panel an 83 overall, 11 players, of course, in the four, uh, three, two, one, uh, one Portuguese player, and that's it. There's no team of the week required for this SBC. The next one is an 84 overall. That's it. No other requirement, and that's in the four, four, one, one. Uh, yeah, a bit unfortunate that uh, but uh, that Portugal couldn't go through. I was potentially expecting a Argentina versus Portugal in final. What? 
what World Cup would that be? That would crash the internet 100%. But this player is fantastic. I am not going to lie. He's fantastic. He looks fantastic. And um, it's up to you. If you guys want to go ahead and complete him, make sure that he fits in your team. He's a Portuguese player, of course, playing for the Portugal's League, Portugal League. But that is fantastic. Boys, this was your FIFA commenter. Drop a like on this video. Subscribe to the channel. Let me know in the comment section below what you thought, what you think about the loss, the, the Portugal loss there, and what you think about this player that we just reviewed. Drop a like. Catch you in another one. Peace out.